My name is Errol Libane. I'm from Prizren, Kosovo. Uh, I am the executive director of DocuFest, the International Documentary and Short Film Festival, which also works in the field of education. Our city, a small city, used to have two cinemas, and there was a very common cinema-going culture, uh, which was destroyed right after the war, right after 99. Uh, the cinema was closed, uh, there was no cultural activities, and a group of friends joined together to uh, reactivate the cinema. So they started with a documentary film festival, and after a couple of years, the festival grew and it became uh, one of the most successful events in the country. This was a big success because it was one of the most innovative uh, projects at that time in Kosovo and uh, we decided to uh, do a more structured approach to this program. So we developed uh, methodical manuals dedicated for teachers who would be capacitated in using film in the classroom and particularly focusing on human rights issues and promoting democratic values. So uh, we started opening up uh, film clubs in different cities and currently we have around 15 film clubs in different cities of, throughout Kosovo. And this was a great opportunity to have a direct interaction with students. We do also use the same methodology we apply on uh, trying to work with youth on preventing the violent extremism. So we are showing films in particular places in Kosovo that are not immune to violent extremism. So we organize screenings, we bring films that talk about the factual media of what has happened in Syria, what has happened in Iraq, what is happening in Afghanistan to try and to tell uh, to young people, to give them the options of getting the right information so they are not affected by uh, different recruiters for you know, foreign fighters. I think that film is an amazing medium that uh, opens up young people's minds. Uh, younger generations are more uh, focused on learning visually these days and uh, if that was not net support for this program if we didn't get uh, this support for many years I don't think that we would be in this position that we are today. <laughs>